scorer basketball. Days not shy, knocked down a three. Well, he had two half minutes to play in this one. Pinson will hit a three in and out. Loose ball, he picks it up. And the floater, that's good. Loose ball, 50 50. LSU has just been attacking Kentucky defensively. Question is, can Kellen Brady free himself up? Boy, the quick hand Gaines has been a difference maker. Eric Gaines can't. The guys who aren't used to handling as much, and Eric Gaines has made a big impact. Days. Oh, that one nearly hit the roof here at the Pete Maravich. This second half started with him making three threes. He hasn't taken a shot in 10 minutes. Well, Gaines wouldn't let him touch it. And look at that difficulty. He has over two defenders screen and make him use it four seconds on the shot clock as they inbounds the ball and it's Easton with the drive got it to go what a shot Tari East Alabama terrific at home of course Tennessee Florida there's Davion Mintz that's a three that's good wow right in the face of Xavier Pinson Gaines with 10 on the shot clock Guarded by Grady, takes him, drops it off. That's a turnover, and Kentucky will have terrific defense, and now a crowd that is on its feet and screaming. Ware, who nearly turned it over, he was able to hang on to it. Well, that was generous. Mince the penetration, lays it up and in over the rim. A one-point game. Where with the near travel, and then Mintz just blows right by Eason, gets between Eason and Days, and is able to get Send LSU to the line. Eason's going to run out in a race with Sheepway. Look at the hustle. Sheepway. And here comes Davion Mintz right into us, the turnover. Eason with the throw. What an unbelievable turn of events. Unbelievable. There's another reach by Pinson. He will duck it, and LSU will end up with a five-point lead. Six seconds to go. And the block and the game. LSU, what a flurry to the finish. Eason and Pinson on a wild exchange that had Davion Mintz in our laps to keep the ball alive, which led to the LSU big dunk. Boy, Shibwe with incredible hustle, and then the mistake to throw it to nobody. And as Mintz tried to keep the ball alive, it ended up in the hands of LSU.